gnome And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my balls keep telling me to let me out Oh, just let me out How's it going lads? Marshall here and welcome to another potential card ratings video. Now I just want to start this by apologising for the last one I did with Ronaldo, uh, Gareth Bale and who the hell else? Luis Suarez. Because my ratings and my predictions were way off the mark. I got carried away. I wanted to be different. I wanted to add a lot of stats to them just to make them look OP as hell. But that, that came off bad. That came off like I was an idiot and um, yeah I was. So I do apologise for that. And today we do have a Barcelona a special. First up, Neymar. If you want to buy any of the players that you do see on screen, by the way, head over to FUT Coins to go and use the code M89 to get yourself 5% off. Neymar's getting an increase from an 84 to an 87, so that is a big increase. Striker to left wing because he plays on left wing more often than not, and Suarez will occupy the striker position. Plus one pace, plus two shooting, plus two passing, plus two dribbling, plus one defending, and no change on their heading. I've kept his five star skills and five star weak foot because you've seen at the World Cup when he did that low drive with his left foot in the first game into the bottom corner he can score from any range with that weak foot so I've kept the weak foot I've kept the skills because obviously this is one of the most skillful guys in the land and he's had an upgrade in most areas apart from his heading where he gets well zero goals with his head he rarely scores with his head next up we do have EA or FIFA's prodigal son Lionel Messi he gets no change whatsoever he sticks at center forward he sticks at a 94 rating as well and as you can see by his base stats they rarely change as well pace no change shooting plus one dribbling plus one passing defending and heading they don't get any change either four star skills three star weak foot and I, the reason why I haven't really changed this card is because I think EA will keep it the same I think they don't like change and I think you guys don't like change either which why the last video went a bit uh, south but anyways that is Lionel Messi I think he will be the highest rated player in the game simply because I think, well it's rumoured anyways, that he's got a contract with EA to be the highest rated player in the game, hence why there was no Pele on the market until a higher rated Messi came out, think of that what you will, but anyways, on to the next one, it's a Barcelona new sign, a new goalkeeper, the German to Stegen, he's getting an upgrade as well from an 80 to an 81, and his base stats get a nice little juicy upgrade as well, diving plus 3, handling plus 1, kicking stays at 78, and his reflex get plus two, his speed stays the same, positioning plus two as well. I watched him a few times last year for Borussia Mönchengladbach and he stays in position a lot of times in goalkeeper and he pulls off some bloody amazing save, hence why I've upped his reflexes. His skill move stays the same and his weak foot is four star. The reason I think he's going to get an upgrade is because um, he love Barcelona and he's going to be the first choice goalkeeper. Well, I think he is anyways unless Bravo takes that berth. I think uh, Chile's Bravo. Let me know who's going to be the Barcelona's uh, number one goalkeeper because I really don't know to be honest well that's it really you've seen all the players we've had Neymar we've had Messi and we've had the brand new goalkeeper to Stegen remember a drop who you want me to predict in that comment section whether it be a team or whether it be a few players whether it be some brand new transfers I just don't know it could be anyone honestly lads and I hope you haven't think I've went overboard with the ratings on this one because last time I did massively and again I do apologize Apologize for that, but these are my opinions, lads. Don't take any of it personally, and I do mean that nothing personally here. Smash the thumbs up if you have enjoyed the video, and as ever, I'll catch you all next time.